Hi, this is Dave from DaveWooding.com. This video is going to show you how to set up um, a program called Putty on your computer so that you can log into your web server and view your uh, traffic stats in real time. So first thing you want to do is go to Google and look for a program called Putty. Here it is. Here's the domain. We want to go to download. Um, I'm on one of these type of computers, so I am just going to do this. It's prompting me, do I want to save the file? You bet I do. Alright, so what am I going to do? I'm going to click on that. Yep, let's go ahead and run it. Okay, there it is. Now, to connect to the web server, I need to know the IP address. And for this one, I'm going to put this in here. Um, I want to have it on SSH, port 22. Let's give it a name. I'll save that. Don't need to load it. Typically, I would click on that. And now I'm just going to say open this black window comes up. It's going to prompt me to log in. Um, on a Unix server, your password should, or typically is, or your username, I should say, is typically root. You need to know what your uh, server password is. It's typically not the same as any of the domains that are hosted on that server. So I've logged in. I want to go to a certain directory. And to do that, I need to cd, which means change directory to slash usr slash local slash apache slash dom logs. Okay. Now I want to go into the next subdirectory that is the username for the website I'm interested in. So for this one, I'm going to go to this one. Now you want to type tail dash f and then your domain name. Okay, and here's what happens. Basically, this is the very last person or IP address that has visited me. I've got some information on where it's coming from. That's the IP address, uh, the page, where they're going to, the browser, etc. I'm going to go over to another browser that you can't see right here and just refresh my visitor to that page. So this next one, that's me. That's my IP in real time right there. That's everything I just did. I hit refresh on that web page. Now I'm going to go visit another page on that website. So watch, I'm going to click on it now. There I go. I went to another page called Members Page. So basically I can see what's happening in real time as visitors show up. I'm going to log in and sorry it doesn't like that because I'm missing my password. Okay, I'm going to go back to the home page. There. So do you see how that uh, goes by and shows me what's happening in real time? Uh, it gives me the IP address, the time date stamp, what's going on, and what page I'm on, and any kind of codes, 304 in this case, browser type, blah blah blah. So that's how you use Putty to view your visitors in real time to see what's going on. And to get out of here, if, I, if I'm done, all I can do is hit Control C. And if I want to get out of this, I'll just simply type Exit. And it'll totally shut that down. So that's how I use Putty to log into my web server to view the visitors on my site in real time.